I like your hair. Thank you. You're welcome. How's it going? I'm Charlie. I'm Jean. Make sure you're tuning in to Multicast and Jean Marie. <laughs> Redwood Cast Ranch. What? We've done the Lost Monarch. We've done whatever the other one that's not called the Lost Monarch up here that's opened is. We've done the Lost Monarch. That's the Lost Monarch. We've done the Emerald Giant, Emerald which was the rock. Yes, it was. What's this one? Today, space? we're going to do a different one for you today. Today, we're going to do the third, the Pipe Dream, Gene. Now, Jean has a story she likes to tell to make fun of me. She likes to tell several stories that make fun of me. The oh, one, that's a heavy about. pour. You know what, we're just gonna do heavy pour. It's a heavy pour day. Okay. Uh, so no, when we were in the liquor store, you're like, hey, I'm gonna get these two cast drinks. And I'm like, wow, we've never had them. We don't oh, know anything about yeah. Redwood. You made fun of me for buying those first yeah. two. And then they were freaking delicious. They were freaking we delicious. Reviewed, we reviewed both of them. Check out, I'll put it, if I remember, which, I might remember. I'll put it in the video's description below. Links to them. This is a cast strength Redwood Empire, the Pipe Dream Bourbon Whiskey. Yeah. Mash bill 74% corn, 20% rye. It's a four grain, folks. Four and a half percent malted barley and one and a half percent wheat. Uh, Jeff Duckhorn is the master distiller. Um, Jeff, uh, feel free to reach out to us and invite us to your distillery because we love your whiskey. We would. We would Just say saying. Yes. No we pressure. Would say yes. No pressure. Just like you did when you got married to this guy. Mm -hmm. Say yes. Yes. Uh, thanks for your subscription. Thumbs up. If you like us, thumbs down. If you don't like me, Gene. What? What do you get? <laughs> it reminds Why? me of our kids. What? Why? Oh my God. What do you get on the nose? Gene Marie. This has got like a soft nose. Really? This is a real buttery, whipped butter, uh, caramel. My first note was uh, ground up Tootsie Rolls. Ground up Tootsie Rolls? Yes, I've not had that note in forever. I got a cherry licorice. Rope, <sighs> cherry rope licorice. 74 corn, was it? Uh, did I say the ABV? I did not. No, I did not say the ABV on a couple of the last reviews now that I think about it. How do you know? I don't know. It's been days ago. 50, uh, it's been about four days ago. 50, shoot. Jeff, we didn't talk. Okay, you're right, your ABV in teeny tiny lettering. Here, you want me to help you? Yeah, and I think it's 58.4. And it's the gold on the brown thing. It is 58.4. Yes, never mind, Jeff. False alarm. Pray continue. You got it? I got it. Okay. So you got a light nose, aged uh, four years old. I got a lot of butter. <sighs> like a Ritz cracker. Ooh, Ritz cracker, yes. Butter, yes. That buttery Ritz cracker? Yeah. I am getting a buttery Ritz cracker, but you know what, Eugene? You, you did, Gene, you put it uh, in between two pieces of rye bread. I don't know why you wouldn't. Why, why would you not? Yeah, that can... uh, Why would you? I don't know, but... <laughs> why? Why? Because you've as had as about as 18 as whiskeys as and as you rye. rye would you. Rye would you. There you go. There you go. Uh, I get a little bit of hint of spearmint. How much rye is in here, did you say? Four and a half percent rye, one That's and a half it. percent wheat. No, it's not. Four and a half percent malted barley. Um, no, it's right. Four and a half. 74 corn, 20 rye. 20, Four okay. Four and a half malted barley, one and a half Because I'm, I'm getting a lot of those rye notes. 20. That spearmint and that, that earthy. I wonder what made him go with a one. Marshmallow. Wheat. Mushroom. A marshmallow mushroom. Oh, you know what? Maybe V's actually written in bigger lettering right there. Mushrooms. I like mushroom notes. I know you do. I need to stop talking about the bottle and start talking about the whiskey. <sighs> Lemon. Yeah, I got a lot of... I, the, the nose for me is, is kind of soft. I'm fitting my nose way down in there, even this heavy pour, way down in there for that big of a uh, cast drink. I have a theory about that. I'm glad you brought that up. I have a theory. If you get your nose down into a cast drink that's above 55, you're going to have a umami uh, notes. Oh, you're going to have a flavorful palate. Oh, you think? Yeah. Well, let's just see about that. Prove me wrong, Gene. I challenge you. Mmm. Mmm. What? Oh! oh. <coughs> oh. I was swirling, and I thought I had my topper still on. It's like, escape, I want to get a jeans pad, not yours, Charlie. You just made me wet. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You know what, what else does that? Yeah, right there. You still got it. <laughs> Self-five. 
Out of the back. Yeah. <laughs> I just lost all my notes. Oh, I'm going. Mmm. <laughs> wow. Dang. How can you lose these notes? It has creamy toffee, melted caramel you left on an apple for too long, and it's just melted. It's going down your popsicle stick. This is a toffee. This is pleasant. I mean, it's 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 really creamy and um, soaks into your taste buds. Just mm -hmm. stays there. Just comes wow. in. It's sweet. It's caramel. It's butterscotch. It's butter. Yeah. It's a whipped topping of sorts. It's got berries. It's got everything in this there. This is like a candy apple had a babies with a caramel apple. I mean, this just screams Halloween treated apples. Mm. That just screams that. Wow. Mm. Easy notes. I mean, some things you're like, oh, I get caramel, I get this. This just slaps you in the face and lets you know it's there. Yeah? Yes. I Dang. Like slap you in the face. See? You still, but my, my theory about the umami notes is correct. <laughs> You mommy. You mommy. You mommy. And I got a Twizzler finish, like a strawberry cherry Twizzler finish. Hmm. This is delicious. It goes for it. Wow. I want to take another drink, but I'm waiting for those notes to still keep on. Yeah, I'm stalling to put water in because I want this finish to keep going. I'm just like just now at the mid palate. Mm. This has a slow transition and a long finish. A, it's a really moist piece of cake. Still lingering on your fork. I need a fork with this. I'm gonna do three drops. The, Not they need to sell forks with these bottles. Now, Redwood Empire. Is it Redwood Empire? Redwood Empire is a California distillery. Hmm. And this makes me, for whatever reason, I'm just getting screaming Paul Bunyan notes. This thing is like long, slow transition, long finish. It's like it's a huge gentlemen that is tall this is the dikembe mutombo of uh whiskeys because he's tall wow what is that note i am trying i'm trying to figure out what this note is i've smelled this before you would you like my whiskey topper no nope i like whiskey toppers if you use a whiskey topper use a whiskey topper i can't i can't put my finger on it take your time they're here to chitter chat with us they came all this way. They're not gonna like stay for four minutes and leave. They drove all the way over here. Do your chat, figure it out. So, underneath this note that I can't figure out what it is, I also get like this, uh, they make these white peaches. Really? Yeah. It's, it's, it's still got a peach flavor or smell Ooh. to it, but it's a little bit softer, more like a pear peach. I'm getting my razzle-dazzle sugar now. Razzle Dazzle's a gum, if you don't, if you're not certain. They still make it, but does not mass produce it like you used to. Maybe a cheese. Maybe this has got like yes. a cheddar cheese. Huh. I'm getting some lemon starburst. Now, the, the caramel is heavy. The, the caramel game is on point with this guy. Mm. Caramel game, still the candied apple, still the caramel apple. Yeah. It's like the state fair, but done the right way. Mmm. <laughs> Damn. Yes, please. I'm wondering, Gene. What? Legitimately, if this is not my favorite of the Empire cast drinks. I know I loved the. Um, well, you'll have to fill yourself up one. The giant was the rye. Fill yourself up Lost one. Monarch was the bourbon. Mm. Um. Yes, I think I actually might like this better than Lost Monarch, mm -hmm. and I love the Lost Monarch. <clears throat> Of memory serves and it does um i'm gonna give this uh a score and i'm gonna do some weird cursive with it i made numbers and cursive this let's just break that up there yep i'm gonna do a 93 gene 90 93 which i think is the 90 might be even the highest score i've done all year you might be right about that <sighs> I think I gave it a high I'm 90. not certain I've got a 92 yet this year because we've just been going through the mm -hmm. stuff that we've had in reserve until you bought these things. But mm -hmm. speaking of bought, 
Oh yeah, I paid a price for you it. You did. Did I, did I, please say I paid less than 100. I have no idea what I paid for it. I know I paid for it. Mm-hmm. Please say. Guess. $55. Ah, I wish. Uh, 75. 76 bucks. Yes, hell yeah. yeah. Buy, buy three of them. Yeah. If I could buy three, I would buy three of these. Buy all three lines. I mean, get, get well, all three. Well, I would buy three of this, be three of that. that I've actually had all, all three this week. Yeah. Anywho. Yeah, but buy all three. Buy it. It's worth it. Buy three of all three. Buy three of all three. Yep, this is 116.4, 116.8, 117.2. I like the bottles. You'll too. have to get some bodies. Dang, that's good. Get some bodies. You should have some bodies. Careful, dude. I know one more on me. <laughs> I've already gotten her wet once today, though. Not be twice. Maybe I'll just put this Oh, uh, yeah, it's waterfall. They can't see what you're doing. <laughs> I'm Charlie. I'm Jean, and I hope you are just as thirsty as we are. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. Mm.